In this short video, I will describe the H2O machine learning framework in Python. H2O is an open source platform that provides convenient tools for predictive analytics. It comes with a web-based graphical user interface for exploring data and building models, but there are also APIs in the most common languages available. It is scalable for big data analytics because it integrates with Hadoop and Spark and connects to the most common databases. Most importantly, it is very easy to learn. We used a dataset from the UCI machine learning repository. The dataset has 30,000 observations with 23 independent and one binary target variable. This is a comparatively small dataset, yet it is suitable for demonstration. Our methods, however, scale easily to larger datasets due to the integration of A2O with big data frameworks. There is also a published paper on the dataset. Training and testing an H2O model is described in three simple steps. Initialize an estimator, train the model, and retrieve the model performance metric on the test data. It is also possible to perform more extensive grid searches by training many more models, and the parameters in this case are selected sequentially or randomly. The search can then be limited by the number of models, by the runtime, and the desired accuracy. We evaluated our H2O models by using AOC scores, which are provided in the project document. We also implemented the sorting smoothing method, which is described in the paper and estimates the actual default probability based on the target labels. We can then plot the actual probability as a function of the predicted probability, which is the model output, and uh, perform a regression and from that derive the slope and the intercept and the R-square values. We can use those numbers to compare our H2O model with the published data. Here on the left side, you can see a published neural network on the same data set, and on the right side, our H2O neural network model. From the graphs and the table below, which show the R-square value, you can infer that our model is at least as good or even better than the published model. In summary, H2O is a new and exciting framework for machine learning. It produces publication quality results, and it comes with many useful tools. It easily scales to larger datasets due to the interfaces with Spark and Hadoop. But not every model is yet available, but the framework is actively under development. In our opinion, this is a really good alternative to more common um, machine learning libraries. We certainly hope that H2O succeeds as a company and as a mainstream data science platform.